Hey everyone, been a while since I did a video. Um, this is about maintaining your dubia colony. So I'm halfway in the middle of this, but I thought, you know, better than late or better late than never. Um, here's what I've done. If you have a dubia colony, you probably end up with gnats at some point. And maybe you wonder, how do I clean this out? How do I put new egg flats in there? How do I clean out the frass? Well, the dirty ones were on this side. Food was on that side. So I shifted the food over. I took the egg flats that were over here and I shook them out really good. And I, I used these food prep gloves, <laughs> just with one hand at least when I'm holding them. Um, but I shake them, I kind of knock them on the side a little bit and get them out. They hang on really well, so you've got to really shake it hard. Um, I take the old egg flats, put them straight in a trash bag, I tie it up. That's where the gnats lay their eggs. Sometimes they lay eggs on the side, so you got to watch out. So what I did, as I got rid of the old ones, I put new ones on this side. I kept the frass and the babies are in the frass. All of that is over here. So how do you get them all over there? Hang on this little one. I'm gonna turn over, there you go. Um, they will, if you take the lid and just cover it up, <laughs> cover up that side. Actually, I'm gonna turn this this way because look what happened. One of them got stuck, I'm sorry. Come here, there you go. Um, I have one of these. These go in plants, so I duct taped it to the top. It hangs down and a lot of the nets, as you can see, uh, cling to that, but I try not to let that, <laughs> if you can hear the mower, I'm so sorry. Um, I try to let that only hang down on the side where there's no egg flats uh, because the roaches, like you just saw, can climb onto that when it's hanging down. So I keep this side in the shade and I've got a light right above it. I'm gonna stir this every now and then so the babies will slowly, see there's one going, go over to the new egg flats and after a little while, I will clean this side out. Too easy. Then I'll slide those back over here, clean out the side that has the food and we're good to go. But that's how we do this. I imagine I'll probably shake the frass every hour or so or stir it with one of these on my hand and eventually they'll all go over to their new little homes so just a quick video to help the people that said hey let me know how you maintain that um, as you have it going if you saw my first video about this it's pretty funny because i screamed <laughs> i was not used to these things um but anyway uh, that's what this is about. So thank you so much. If you've got questions about dragons or dubia roaches, I've never kept worms. I don't know anything about that, really. Um, put it in the comments, and if you need a video, I'll do a video for you. So thank you all for watching. Please like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Thank you.